Which comes to going to clear up But on a happy face do 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 You see, Suzanne, the secret to getting ahead in broadcasting is... Mm-hmm. Actually, when I started years ago... Mm-hmm. Now, young people like you ought to... Dick, I think I should go back over and do another story about those mugwum people. Really? Well, I'm surprised to hear you say that. Well, it's just that... I can't get them off my mind. There was something about them. Something about that passion and determination. And that Molly Codler was so... I don't know. When I was interviewing her and she asked me to hold her because she was afraid, I just felt it was such a true moment. Uh, it's only the journalist in me who wants to follow up on the story. Well, of course, Suzanne, it's... Certainly not because oh, you'd want to spend a lot of time with those characters. Uh, but uh, I'll have to drop you off. Uh, I've got to run by and see my wife. But before we do, I've, I've got a little lotion here in the glove box, and I'm wondering if you could put it on me. For God's sake, Dick, could you put the top down on the car? My hair. My hair is... It's... My, my hair is blowing. I... I, I've got to be on camera, and my hair is getting messed up. Look out, Dick. Look out, my hair. I'll just turn around here and drop you off. I'll pick you up later. What was that? Did you feel that bump? Just take me over and drop me off. I'll have a camera crew meet me there. Okay, um, is my lighting okay? Because my hair feels a little fucked up. Is it okay? Okay. Okay, ready? All right, here we go. All right. This is Suzanne Stroke, reporting again for Eyewitness News. As you can see, Dick, the supporters of Neo Mugwump are committed to maintaining a vigil. Supporters say they'll stay as long as it takes. At this hour, internet rumors of Neo Mugwump's whereabouts are just that, rumors. Stay with Eyewitness News for more details. So, um, you're lesbians. What's it like? Uh, how is it being a, uh, a lesbian? I'm not sure I know any lesbians, or that I've ever known any lesbians, although one of my sorority sisters did have suspiciously hairy legs. So, um, any, any news of Molly Codler? Is she around? Well, hi, Suzanne. Hi, Molly. Hi. Hi. Hi, Molly. Hi there, Molly. I just came by because, well, I'm not sure why. I I guess you wouldn't understand. It's just that, well, I've been thinking about you and... Um, yeah, I might understand. I might have a little bit of an idea. Now, when you say that you and Mugwump are exes, you were in a relationship? Yes, but that was years ago. It's over now. I see. Are you still close? Close? What's close? You mean are we fucking? Absolutely not. I wouldn't fuck Neo Mugwump for a million dollars. It's one of those I don't even know what I was thinking deals. Oh, you must be involved with someone else. Nope, not at the moment. Free as a bird. Free as a bird. In fact, I'm free as a bird. Really? 
Hmm. Are you lonely, Molly? Well, Suzanne, I'm pretty popular. I wouldn't say I was lonely, but... Why, yes, I'm very lonely. How about you? My life is full, and I have my career, and then there's Dick. I, 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 I adore Dick. Dick is, is, uh, is everything to me. I, I would say that Dick is the most important thing in my life. Okay, whatever you say, but let's stop talking about Dick. Tell me about yourself, Suzanne. Surely a girl like you's got more going on than just Dick. Of course, even Dick gets old sometimes. I don't know. Maybe it's just the journalist in me, but... I'm curious about you, Molly. I'd like to know more. What are your dreams, Molly? What are your hopes? I want to know you, Molly. You. The real you. What goes on behind that non-blinking eye of yours? Well, the eye thing has its benefits. You know, I've developed some workarounds. Well, I I'm a little embarrassed to ask, but how do you, you know, what with, since you don't have a mouth? Well, now you're getting kind of personal, Suzanne, but the truth is I've developed a special technique for touching women using my eye. I see. Oh, I see. They seem to really like it, and, you know, it's not a big deal because they can still go down on me. Well, Suzanne, the truth is, this eye is really just somewhat of a mask that I use to hide behind and keep myself safe. My heart's been broken, but I'll survive. Show it to me, Molly. Show me. Show me all of you. I... I feel so, so close to you suddenly, and it's as if, it's as if I have a small fire burning between my legs. I've never really felt this way before. Let's see what's behind that Molly Codler eye. You're, you're beautiful, Molly. Beautiful in every way. I can see your soul. Oh. I kissed a girl. Oh. 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 I kissed oh. a girl. Oh. 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 <laughs> excuse me there, uh, 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 excuse me. Uh, anybody seen Suzanne Stroke? Shit, there's Dick. Shit, Dick. Shit, it's coming, Dick. Coming. Molly, call me, call me, call me at the station, call me at home, just call me. Just remember, look at the moon, I'll be looking too, and we'll be there, together. Oh, thank God, Dick, get me the fuck away from these dykes. I kissed a girl. Shit, why does this always happen to me? Why does this always happen? Hi. I'm Lisa Parrish from our chart. And, oh, my, oh, oh, my lordy Lou. Uh, uh, well, listen, muffins. Um, has anybody seen a uh, beaver? Oh, oh, I get it. Oh, funny. Oh, uh, I mean, no, the busy beaver. Have you seen the busy beaver? Oh, uh, uh, oh, sorry, sorry. <coughs> <coughs> Mojopo, stay the Mojopo. I told you to stay the fuck away from here. Do you hear me? Do you I hear me? Oh, for crap's sake, Lisa. Lisa. Hey, 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 chicks. I'll leave that. Lisa, what are you doing? Oh, God, Lisa. Lisa.